Good afternoon. Uh, for my educational person I chose to study about uh, was John and Amos Comenius. Um, he lived from 1592 to 1670, and he grew up in Morava, which now and today is in part of the Czech Republic. Um, when he was at an early age of 12, um, he had a, a big uh, life event that hit him. Uh, his parents passed away, um, but luckily he was able to go live with his aunt and attend two different universities. Uh, after graduating them two universities, he came back home and he was ordained in the Brethren Church um, to become a pastor. After he was a pastor for a couple of years, um, he was able to move up to become a bishop in the local church. And the while he was doing that, um, the 30 year war started between the Catholic and the Protestants. And so with this, uh, they started to move into his town in Mariva and so he had to flee to Poland to get away from the persecution. Um, while he was in Poland, um, he would write back and forth with his kids and wife. Um, he found out that they had passed away due to a plague that the Spanish had brought up through his local community. Um, after he was in Poland, uh, he was asked to travel to different places to spread some of his educational philosophies and educational beliefs um, to the communities to see um, if he could help them out. Um, he was able to travel to England, Sweden, Prussia, Hungary, and Amsterdam. Um, and while he was doing these different places, he continued to do his writing and would, wrote over 200 uh, different books of educational stuff and also um, his biblical teachings some of his personal philosophy of educational ideas was that he believed everyone had the opportunity to get education. It didn't matter if you, what race you was, what gender, um, who you were, what uh, social class you was. He believed that you had the opportunity or should have the opportunity to return a, or get an education. He thought through education, um, it could reform the society by teaching the kids at early age what actual truth was, uh, how to know truth and how to gain knowledge. And teachers were to be professional in knowing uh, their topic. They should know everything about it. They should be professionals and be role models to these students, especially since um, growing up, going to school, they see the teachers just as much as they see their family. Um, one big thing that he also included in the teachings that he wanted the teachers to do was to integrate biblical teachings um, so that they could know the truth. Since he thought that God was all-knowing and he knew all the knowledge and to get closer to God was to, get, uh, to learn knowledge, gain wisdom, and grow closer to him. Thank you for this short video.